It was a bright, sunny afternoon on the Gmod Railway. On the, on the trainway district of the railway, Alex, Alex, Justin, Scott, and the twins, Donald and Douglas, well, at least, well, the twins, Donald and Douglas, were telling Alex and Justin about the diesels on their railway since, di since diesel arrived. So, what are the diesels like over there? Are they like the ones we have here? Are they big and bulky, and do they need more than one of them to pull freight? Ah, no! They... They can pull freight cars all by themselves. Oi! I've seen diesels pull like a hundred... Like nearly a hundred cars in, in, in... With just by themselves. Uh, how do they not collapse under the weight of the cars? Ah, ah, Sir Truss, we don't know anything about diesels. Oi, them diesels are, are pretty much a complete mystery. Well, to us at least. <laughs> I, I know those diesels very well. Especially the ones like Diesel, even though he's out. He was among the many diesels that are on the railways in, in the UK. Ah, Scotsman raises a good point. Those diesels took over out out of the railway back in the like nineteen late fifties or or sixties I think. Ah, I too can barely barely remember what the, what the diesels back in the UK were like. Are there still any more of them operating there? I I there is a lot of them as. Still operator, still operating over, over there. You're kind of a snub in your accent there. Oh, ah, uh, ah, uh, sorry. I've just been kind of rusty lately, and, and it's actually the sun that's kind of messing me up. Hang on. Wait a minute. Do you smell that? Ugh, smells like diesel. Oh, I can smell it too. Can you two smell it? Ah! I have not smelled anything like that since back in Scotland. Well, that can only mean one thing. And I think I know where that smell is coming from. Alex was right. A new diesel has just arrived on the Gmod Railway. And Alex's guess has proof has proven to be correct because a new diesel has just arrived. Hey, I see someone down there. Well, well, I'll be. Who could that be? I don't know. Ah, who are you two talking about? What the? Ah, oh no, another diesel. Engines, this is our newest diesel. This, this is Daryl. He, Daryl here is a BR Class 17 diesel. He will be our shunter. Ah, ah, Daryl, it has been a long time since, since I've last seen you. Welcome to the Gmod Railway.
Oh, why, thank you, Scotsman. It is a pleasure to see you again as well. On YouTube must be the twins, Donald and Douglas. I've heard a lot about you, and I have especially been dying to meet you two. Because Mr. Freeman here told me all about you, and... Well, I'll be. If it ain't the two old-time Western locos, Alex and Justin, you two are looking marvelous. Even though you are both over 120 years old, you two look absolutely outstanding in that paint. Oh, uh, <laughs> thank you. Wow, Justin, can you believe how kind this diesel is compared to diesel? Yeah! He's actually one of the kindest diesels I've ever met! <laughs> uh, Donald here's one of the kindest diesels you, you, will, you will ever meet. Uh, Donald? Douglas? Ah, ah, I cannot believe that we got another diesel. Oi, you'll have to prove yourself. Oh, oh, come on, why can't you two be nice for once? And why can't you stop being so vulgar to diesels like me? You all need you all need a shunter. Because you all can't fetch your cars and coaches by yourselves. So that's why I'm here. I'm here to help you all out. Exactly. Anyway, engines, I have some assignments for each of you. Donald, Douglas, you two will be doing some patrolling around Sunset Gulch because we're planning to do some tours there, especially tours of the underground where Alex did his first job on his first day. I sir. Yes, yes, sir. Scott? Scott? Your, your first... Scott? Your first official assignment will be pulling two special passenger coaches along with your water tender around Sunset Gulch from... I am just going to try and put you on the same trial run that Alex did, just to see how strong you are, and, and since Alex took not that long to get there, I hope that you'll be fine without using your water tender for, no, for this job. Yes, sir. Anything, an, anything for this railway. That is, that is very good to hear. Daryl here will fetch your... That, that's good to hear. Daryl here will fetch your coaches when you're ready. But, but Justin? Oh, here we go. Justin, you'll be pulling a pair of tank cars from, from another yard, of which I will let you all know which yard Justin will be doing this in. But for now, that's all for tonight, everyone. Have a good day, and, and see you all tomorrow. So, Daryl, is it? You are one of the weirdest, not, not to be mean, but you are one of the weirdest looking diesels I've ever seen. I mean, what is up with that boxy shape? No offense. I'm non taken. I, I, this is just how I was built. We be all, we are. We BR-17 class diesels are some of the strongest diesels in the UK. We can even shunt like five or six coaches to a station in one go, without uh, and almost without having any problems. That's how strong we BR-17 class diesels are. Ah, I can, I can vividly remember the first, the first time you came to Scotland. Oi. Oi, you diesels completely took took over the, our, our railway. Alright, alright, why don't you two stop being so vulgar and just be nice to me for once. I am the new diesel here. In fact, I am this railway's second diesel. Except that I am going to be the last diesel that will be arriving here and, and, and that will be here for, for a while. You know, Alex? Yeah? Do you remember that time when I said I hated diesels? Well, now I actually changed my mind. I'm actually starting to like the diesels. Wait, what? Yeah. 
Daryl here seems like a very kind fellow. Isn't that right, Daryl? Indeed. And as a matter of fact, Mr. Freeman here told me the story that, that you told uh, Scott there and, and the twins. Isn't that right, Donald and Douglas? Uh, on, all right, all right, don't get yourselves in a twist. Donald, Donald and Douglas, he didn't mean that. He's just trying to be kind, so... So how about you two stop being a pair of complete asses and just be nice to this fella? Ah, fine, ah, fine. I guess the old engine that raises a good point. Hey, I'm not that old. Uh, all right, all right, there is no need for a temper. Oi, oi, you was just saying. He was not meaning to offend you. Uh, why does everyone always have to make fun of my age? Well, I'm surprised that this diesel's not bullying us like like almost every other diesel does. Uh, uh, when I was well, when I was rebuilt, I was bullied a lot by diesels, but I just let it slip out of my mind. Walter off a dog's back, as I as I know, which means whatever. Like the insult hits you, just just let it slide out of your mind, like all water slides off a duck's back. Oh, all right, that makes sense. <laughs> uh, oh, you steam engines cracked me up. Anyway, anyway, it is a pleasure to be here. I'm sure you'll fit right in. Indeed. So from then on, Daryl has been these. So from then on, Daryl is now the second diesel on the railway, and is and and is and it's going to prove to be a really useful shunter.